they call us the Space Sweepers. My name is Ayuma Kino. I am Director of Astroscale Singapore, as well as Chief Information Officer at the Astroscale Group. Astroscale is an orbital debris removal company. In space, about 9,000 satellites out there, but only 1,000 satellites are active. The remaining 8,000 are dead. Those big ones can be a few meters long or a few ton size. So think about those ones that are colliding each other, creating more debris. It will be a disaster in a space. So why this is a problem? It is because of the Kessler syndrome. Unless we try to clean up, space won't be usable because debris start colliding each other, creating more debris through chain reactions. That's gonna threaten our future space activity, as well as all the benefit what we've received from space, such as GPS, weather forecast, and the disaster management. Astroscale tried to solve this issue by ADR and EOL. ADR is active debris removal. That's for existing debris, which is already up there in the space. Those debris going around really fast, so going after the debris is one of the difficult technology we try to develop. Once we identify this is debris indeed we want to capture, then we will grab it using a robotic arm, and then we will bring it down to atmosphere. The entry point, it burns up. On the other hand, for upcoming new launches, we provide this EOL, end-of-life services. This is mainly for commercial satellite operator. We collaborate with them. We ask them to put docking plates on their satellites before the launch. Docking plates has a magnetic feature as well as marker capability. So it's easier to identify for us which one we want to capture. Once we attract to that object, we will bring it down to atmosphere, exactly the same way as ADR. We will burn it. So three key challenges we face. The first one, technology. Building satellites with capturing mechanics is very difficult. Nobody done it in the world. So we are pretty much the first pioneer to tackle it down. Two, business case. We try to convince our business partner to use our services for space sustainability. But this is not just an environmental issue, but also their business sustainability as well. Three, regulation. There is no one single government who oversees all the space activities. Space is for everyone. Nobody owns the space. Because of that, it's very difficult to put in place rules and guidelines. Astroscale try to tackle those three key challenges that I mentioned. And I'm so proud of myself to be in this team and to try to tackle together to try to contribute safe and sustainable space environments for the next future generations.